Hey, Pip Blanche and Alpacas, this is Livy, and finally, thank God, 2020 is gonna be over tomorrow. It's gonna be over tomorrow. <laughs> and, oh my God. And I know most of my ever, like, you know, last video of the year videos, like, except last year I did a Resident Evil and Cuphead crossover, which you guys really like, and it also got copyright claimed, not strike claimed. As I was saying, most of my last video of the year, I always say, oh my god, what a great year, this is a good year, that so many good things happened this year. If I said that about this year, I would be lying. I would be so lying. Like, there were a few good things, like, right now... <laughs> This one here is trying to bite me because she hears me yelling and she knows there's something wrong and she would not leave my lap. But there were a few good things like like we did get especially a lot with Cuphead news. Oh my god. Like we got new books and we got a official sneak preview. Well, not sneak preview, but sneak peek of the Cuphead show. And also, I got to talk with Mrs. Grey Delisle, and who is also Miss Chalice. And also, she had. I keep on saying also. I have an also calendar. <laughs> she plays Miss Chalice, and she agreed to do an interview on my channel without me even asking anything. So that's good. And I'm trying to find other um, voice actors, and I'm even interested in interviewing storyboard artists. So I'm still trying to contact them and they still haven't answered yet I'll, I'll like keep going but I won't be annoying about it and the only one that I'm having a challenge with because I don't know how to contact him is True Valentino who is the voice actor for Cuphead. He's not really active on his Twitter and like the last time he was active on his Twitter was like in 2017? Maybe? I have some viewers that are helping me out like contact Troop Valentino. The one simple request I have is please don't spam him about it. Please don't be annoying to him about it because I don't want to be that person to be annoying to him and also it's not gonna look good on my part. But yeah, in 2021, the Cuphead show is coming and there's gonna be a lot of things on the channel next year about the Cuphead show. I'm working on more top tens and I'm actually working on what I would hopefully be a official Cuphead book. Like right now it's unofficial, but um, after I'm done writing it, like I'm I'm working so hard on it. It's not just a fan fiction. I'm working really hard on this book and maybe show it to Studio MDHR when I'm done and see what they think about it. But yeah, I really want to write a Cuphead book so bad. I'm not going to tell you what it's about because I don't want anybody stealing my ideas. <laughs> and Baker, please be quiet while I'm talking to these people. And so yeah, I am working on a Cuphead book and it's going to take a while. Like, I... I've been working on it for weeks and it's still like, you know, not even halfway in the book yet. Not even quarter to halfway through the book. But yeah, hopefully I'm going to write a book and absolutely make it official if I can. But right now I'm I'm still in the process of writing it and who knows, maybe it might not be done next year. And also next year in August, I'm gonna be 30. Yeah my 30th birthday. If you're turning 20 the in 2021, or if you turn 20 this year, enjoy your 20s while they last. Enjoy your 20s while they last. That's my biggest advice. And Baker, quit biting me. She bites me when I yell. I don't even think I'm yelling. But yeah, she's been liking Beaker's been liking the fact that when I work on the computer, I always have a blanket in my lap and she likes to hop in and sleep on my lap while I'm on the computer. And and just so you know, the book I'm talking about is not Once Upon a Cup, so calm down about that. Like, I'm still thinking about ideas for Once Upon a Cup, but I'm not too strict on Once Upon a Cup as I am about this one that I'm writing right now. Oh my god, I'm just really excited about the Cuphead show. And again, I've mentioned this in the video my last video actually, and I want to mention it again. Do not expect the Cuphead show to come out tomorrow, because it's not going to. It is not going to, it was said so by the staff, it's gonna come out in the summer. We can all wait, it's fine. We might have like 
a little surprise, maybe, but I can't guarantee you that. I can't promise you that. Again, I don't work for Studio NDHR. I really want to. I want to work for the Cups. Hey, maybe 2021 might be my year to work for the Cups. But as of right now, no, I don't. And even if I did, I can't tell you that unless they're okay with me telling you that. But oh my god. And thank you for watching. Thank you for the all the new subscribers this year. And I know shortly I'm gonna hit 3,000 subscribers. Wow. <laughs> and yep, Beaker says Happy New Year. And so I will see you next year or next week. Pretty much <laughs> all the same. So we'll see ya. Thank you